Thank you, Mike. You probably don't think long and hard about the storm drains on your street, but now as New Center 16's Maria Catanza Wright reports, you might think twice when you see some in Elkhart County. This isn't graffiti or a glorified doodle. This was a way to draw attention to the storm drains and how to make a difference by less pollution. Those poor little afterthoughts often packed with leaves and plastic lids. Most communities have issues with pollutants getting into, into a waterway. That's partly why my community, My Water, is spearheading the Storm Drain Art Project for 2019. In the past, eight have been beautified in Goshen. This spring, eight drains will be decorated in the Maple City. The same number also for Elkhart. It allows artists to, uh, to have an opportunity to be noticed in the community, but then again, it is making a difference with the environment. Because what goes in here goes out there into the Elkhart River. Stormwater is the only type of water pollution that is increasing at this time. And, and so anything that we can do to reduce the amount of pollutants that are going into our storm drains or being picked up by, by stormwater is, is going to improve our, the quality of our water. We just want them to think about how they can make a difference in their environment. And it's not always big, huge changes. Sometimes it's just little things that you change, whether it's picking up trash that's near the storm drain or not putting your lawn clippings in the, in the street. But a painted drain is enough to make us pause and think it's up to all of us to keep our rivers clean. Maria Catanzarite, New Center 16. Coming up on New Center 16 at 6, find out how you can get involved in the Storm Drain Art Project in Elkhart County.